An abstract is a summary of your work, so you should treat it a bit like the synopsis on the back of a book. It should be as brief as you can possibly make it, so about 150 to 300 words, depending on what you're writing your abstract for. And if you break it down into its component parts, you'll find that it actually has the same structure as your lab report or your dissertation. The first paragraph in a journal article is very often the abstract, and this is what you're trying to emulate in your own work. So there are four elements to an abstract. There is the purpose, the method, the results, and the conclusion. So let's say that you were writing an abstract for a lab whereby you measured heart rate in response to various types of stimuli. All you'd need to do is to fill in the four blanks to put your abstract together. So the purpose would be, does pet therapy work? The method would be to measure the heart rate of participants who were either petting a dog or looking at a photo of a dog. The results would be that the test subject's heart rates were lowest during their interaction with a dog. And the conclusion is that contact with dogs is good for health, so it could be a treatment for anxiety, and we need to do further research into the effects. So if you put all those parts together, what you'll end up with is a brief and concise abstract. Pet therapy, or animal-assisted therapy, has been gaining popularity in US and UK medical settings since the 1980s. Patients and staff have reported feeling calmed and reassured by interacting with dogs during pet therapy. However, the physiological benefits of this treatment are poorly understood. To explore this, we measured the heart rate of participants before, during and after a 10-minute interaction with a dog. All participants reported having no fear or anxious feelings towards dogs and a control group was observed while viewing a photograph of a dog. The test group's heart rate measurements were lowest during their interaction with a live dog, while the heart rates of the control group didn't vary significantly. We conclude that direct contact with dogs can produce positive physiological effects in the human body. Pet therapy can induce relaxation by slowing the heart rate and could therefore be posed as an effective treatment for anxiety. Further research is proposed into whether the reported effects are long or short term. So if you follow that formula, you'll always end up with a really good quality abstract. And it's actually the same formula that academics use when they're writing their journal articles. If you need any more information about this or any other aspect of writing, you can find us on our website where you can also book an appointment to come and see one of us in Leeds.